WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a mixed bag out there. The mix goes like this. You've got the Dow up 56 points, less than two-tenths of a cent. Uh, the S&P is down three points. That's basically flat. The NASDAQ is up eight points. That's basically flat. Russell's off three points, a quarter percent to the downside. Semis are up one full percentage point, $35.69. Trannies are off 40. So we've got that mixed bag out there. We've got gold up 10 bucks. Silver's up 30 pennies. Like we crude up a buck forty two, natural gas off six cents, thirty year treasury down nearly one point, trade out at one fourteen oh three. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel. Market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES Mini. It's in our upper left-hand corner. Will be momentarily. And in the case of the ES Mini, what is today? Today is bar number eight of a TD nine count. Now, the high of the count can come on bars eight, nine of the bar following nine. Quite frankly, the high must come on bars eight, nine of the bar following nine. So we've got a successful bar number eight today. We likely will get a successful TD nine count top tomorrow. Remember, ninety percent of the time that you successfully get to bar eight, it will go ahead and complete and form that pattern. However, or not really a however, this is kind of the interesting thing here. Let's just say that you and I were going to go ahead and take a short right now where this new profile that is forming, is attempting to form, and support is down at 43.39. So we'd have to be telling ourselves that the sellers are going to be able to take out that level of resistance or support, I should say, where the buyers are at. Now, you've got the spot volatilix that is also going to form a TD9, or is likely to form a TD9 count bottom. Bar number eight forming today. We can cover the details during the Trader's Ed show with regard to what needs to happen for this pattern to complete tomorrow but of course you'll be with me tomorrow we'll be able to take a look at that in the case of the nq also forming bar number eight of a td9 count attempting to form a new profile this one has shifted by the top of that box at 15 432 the bottom at 14 984 we take a look at the u.s dollar index just consolidating with inside its daily profile between 10491 10675 you've got a td9 count bottom that's likely going to form inside of goldilocks it was the td9 count that i identified its most recent high. Silver is consolidating with inside its daily profile. Very strong support at 2253. Light Sweet Crude is going to confirm a TD9 count bottom today. We'll take a look during the Trader's Edge show where price is likely to head to. Natural gas is an A to B equals CD to the downside. Needs a bullish reversal candle short of that in order to form a buy the D point pattern. Short of that, price will target 296. We've got a bar number eight inside the 30-year treasury. Looks like that's getting ready the top as well. So we're going to have some action, Jackson. Stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show. But if you have to start the whole thing today, please have a good Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon.